Hello YouTube, today I am going to be showing you how to never backlash again. Let's get right into it. The number one trick to not getting a bird's nest is to make sure that your settings are adjusted just right based on the weight of the bait you're using. To start adjusting your bait caster to the right setting, you must make sure your break knob is adjusted. So if you're a beginner, just set that to the middle. And if you're a little more experienced, you can set it slightly looser. Now onto your tension knob, which is right which is right here. You're going to want to set this all the way clockwise. Then click the spool release button and the bait will most likely not move. So then you are going to turn the tension knob slightly counterclockwise. You're going to do this until the bait uh, until you're going to do this until the bait finally starts to move. Once you have the bait slowly falling, you want to adjust it so when it hits the ground, the spool does not spin extra at all. Then, you know your tension knob is adjusted correctly. Once you have that adjusted, you're going to want to take a cast and make sure your thumb was touching or very close to touching the spool. And once the bait hits the ground or the water or whatever you were aiming at, you have to stop the spool from overspinning. And that's how I keep myself from getting a bird's nest.